Where is the boat? It was in your woods, I think? Yes. Here, dog. Where my dog's at. Your A trip by boat. That's Ograin Grottoes. But the item that I have allows one to use the boat in Ograin Grottoes. Hmm. Don't recall a boat. do not recall a boat here. Do recall that guy, though. Here he's so good. Boat. Oh no, I have to fight all these people. There's no boat here. Just take it for what it is. There ain't no boat here. Alright, let's move on with our lives. I'll press the right buttons eventually. Main story. Oh man, the cattle is gone. How awful. Is this the result of the battle three months ago? Not quite. Uh, when Tarn's first foot soldiers arrived over Cortara, Lord Sigurd had already surrendered. This happened yesterday. The smoke is still rising. My dear Heinlein, you are well. May I introduce you to our, uh, to, may I introduce to you all our contact? I don't know what that means. I am so relieved to see you again. I hope a simple servant such as myself can be of service. Uh, if this is not the result of the battle, then what happened here? You have surely heard that Nabrelia is mobilizing their armies against Volandis, 
now that their war for succession has ended. King Frederick is doing the same, and he is confiscating resources throughout Escania, food, equipment, materials, and young men. Villages that can't provide supplies are severely punished, and here in Basil, he made the first example. My brother, what is he thinking? He has the Grand Grimoire in his possession. He should be able to defeat the enemy with ease. Why these means? Why this brutality? I am but a humble servant and in no position to judge. Heinlein, uh, you know why we are here. Indeed, in order to get to Princess Amalia, we need to meet up with another contact. He's waiting in Farnsport. Let's get going right away. Lead the way. Frederick, this is going too far, even for you. Hold on a second. I know I said we were going to do main story quest, but... But... There's a couple of things. Check up on Tome of Fiend. That's pretty pricey. Uh, items? Is this Tome of Fiends? All monsters for sky armor battles can drop skill ram now. Interesting. I have three sacred waters. That's a lot. Supposedly, there's only one more um, uh, class. So maybe there's two more classes after that. All right. I think I have enough crit stuff to do crit stuff. Is that enough crit damage stuff? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wow, this is a crit damage three, one slot purity five. That's pretty insane. Trying to be greedy right now, but here we go. Okay. And then we just need two. I'll oh, grab that one. Okay, so what happens when I... Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, it doesn't technically show that there's more. I'm certainly curious if there is more. Let's see, for crit up, we have a five with purity one. That's not going to take us anywhere. Um, let's see, I gotta remove crit damage. Okay. 
I'm wondering why it didn't make any noise. Damage. And go up. And a dry strike. This is our death sentence. I don't think we can ever recover from this. Can't go inside the mansion. Have I been in there? It took me 15 years to build this house. They burn it down within two hours. have been in here. There was just a treasure chest. We sell the best weapons. No, you don't. mannequins if I want to talk to mannequins. All right, let's let's get the step. Here we are. I guess this resistance has seen better days. Who are you? What are you doing here? It's just us, sir. I mean, Faran. Uh, these are the people who want to help us. Help them? Which one of you is the leader? Glenn, your turn. What? Get to the point. What do you want? We're here to talk to... with Amalia. Amalia, the princess. I don't know how to be of any help to you. Our goal is to destroy the Grand Grimoire and end this reign of terror. What naivete. Alas, you will be hanged for such words. But you can trust us. <laughs> trust? That's your argument. You're the lousiest leader I've ever seen. Aren't you, Heinlein? You tell me about help and bring me an old man, some woman, uh, and children. Run, we fly under Lady Brand's flag. We are not many, but we have more to offer than what I can see here. The boy offers pathos while you provide insults. 
What's the point of this? Look around you. Who are you trying to protect with your cautiousness? Do you think your secrecy will keep you safe from Tarin? If we were on Tarin's side, we would have already killed every one of you and saved ourselves any discussion. We have an airship and four sky armors. Actually, we have like five. Uh, these children and women, as you call them, are capable fighters. We want to put all these resources at Amalia's disposal. Freeze. Drop all your weapons. We know exactly what you are doing here. Blood and piss. Poor timing. Your lie is lifted while still being told. Such nonsense. As you can see, they're interested in our heads, too. You will have to use force. Did see a dry. Weak against Earth. Light. What a sucker. Ooh, the double paralyze? Maybe this is proof of your trust. Can we really trust them, Heinlein? But of course, Veron. I can see insecurity and fear in this boy's eyes, but they also lend truth to his words. I shall believe you. Thank you. Without you, they would have bested us. Molly is not here. Our resistance has been exposed. We were surprised and arcant. Uh, one group was killed, the other was taken prisoner. We are the pitiful remnants. Do you know where she is now? She is being held at a military base near Arkant. Then let's leave immediately. You mean to free her? We need to assess the situation at the location first. You can't do that. Uh, at least not without us. What a disgrace it would be if I entrusted Amalia's life to strangers and didn't lift a single finger myself. You want to join us? Well, what do you think, Glenn? We're gonna need your help. Lad, are you really the leader? Forgive my words. Who am I to talk? I'm not cut out to be a leader myself, and I'm probably projecting this onto you. Let's go. New party member? Being a leader, can I really do this? He is not a new party member. Suck. Interesting that um, the passive skills, it shows three more. There must be some point where we can equip three more uh, passive skills. Um, you have so much SP. Like, where do I even put it? Chained Echoes going. It has been going. We've made progress. We've done some things. We've done some side quests. We've done some things. We've made progress. We could have done more things. I uh, could have struggled less against that buried treasure. 
you know. You know. Things be going. Really, I can't teleport to Arkant. So, this button. Ion Oasis. Uh, very well. We'll do it as discussed. Sir Glenn. Sir? My men have taken up positions on the far side of the camp. They will use targeted attacks to distract the enemy. Your men are still recovering. It's too dangerous. There is a toll to pay on the road to freedom. Some pay it with gold. They will pay it with blood. In the meantime, we'll get to Amalia and free her. Exactly. Fortunately, the air route is out of the question. The anti-sky armor cannon would take us out of the air immediately. We should try to stay on the ground undetected. That means we should avoid any combat, if possible. Should be a way to sneak past the enemy. Can you hear the battle racket? It has begun. Godspeed, everyone. Eight treasure chests. On other news, you recently found out that a director that works under you in the company now has been having an affair with someone from their own department. So she's getting fired at the end of the week. What's, uh, <laughs> I need, <laughs> I need, uh, some context. Is, is, oh, okay, I, I know the answer to this question, but I'm going to ask it anyway. Is this person getting fired because it's a manager having a relationship with somebody who is in in the same like someone who who uh, basically a conflict of interest scenario? That's basically what I'm trying to say. Unable to act is rough times considering those were both of my main damage dealer. Also, they missed and I still got the unable to act. Also, it was two turns. My goodness. pretty crossed out about him having an affair, but the company problem is he's doing it within his own department, and it is an undeclared relationship between a manager and someone who he's responsible for. That is that is the information that uh, I was looking for, because uh, I, I personally find it a little ridiculous for people to be like, you're having an affair with somebody. That's that's amoral. We're we're letting you go. Like that's none of your business. People can people do whatever they want to do.
but there there is certainly uh, there is certainly an issue with a a manager having a relationship with someone that reports to them. Then again, that's just one of the the woes of of being in the workplace, isn't it? You know, you you're working with certain people uh, basically all the time, and uh, you know those are the people that you're going to be interacting with the most, and you know, all that other crazy stuff. So, of all the people that that you're you're likely to form a relationship with somebody, it's it's going to be someone like that. This is why you don't get into relationships in the workplace. Huge waste of time. Oh. Never mind, I got a treasure chest and I found a merchant. Once again, they're giving me access to guns, but I haven't found a gun person yet. Little suspicious. So the game is alluding to me that I should be able to go around those enemies that I just saw. Okay. Looks like the game was not lying to me. Uh, you don't need to make decisions for someone outside the work, but him doing it within the work is an incredible issue. We found out because the employee wanted to break it off, and he threatened to make her job unpleasant if she stopped seeing him. So she came to you with the situation. Oh my gosh, why is it always the stereotypical, uh, like, aspect of it? What is going on with people? <laughs> oh my gosh. Every time, every time you hear about this issue, it's it's the stereotypical 
part of it. You know, the person is abusing their power. And uh, I, I just did sexual harassment training for this. Uh, quid pro quo. That's the term they used. Princess, are you all right? Ron, calm down, Cress. How did you manage to get here? With the support of this brave troop, a clan fighting, uh, fighting for our cause. Sir Victor. And Princess Celestia. Princess? Celestia? Greetings, but we don't have time to chat. Stop right there. Throw down your weapons, intruders. There's nowhere to run. How did they find us so quickly? Wasn't the distraction of your men enough, Ferran? Kill them. People often abuse the power they are given. It's true. sure to follow. Let us be on our way. No. Princess? Don't call me that. That title no longer carries any meaning. I am nothing but a prisoner. If you want to free me, you must save the others as well. There are more of our comrades being held captive further east. Ah, you're our next character, eh? Princess of Ascania and, well, maybe not. I, they've done this for some other people, I think. An only survivor of the succession dispute between the 29 children of late King Droglin IX. As rumors tell, she only survived because of the pact she made and the curse of healing she received. Amalia is an eager young girl who doesn't like to depend on others, although her heart beats in the right place. Social conversations are not her strong point. With all due respect, we don't have time for that. Not leaving without our men, Faron. And we have no choice. She is the party member. Okay, maybe, maybe they did do that only for party members. And she does use a gun. Okay, you have 43 attack. We have to figure out what you are. Heals targets with a potency of 0.8, all, but is unable to act next turn. Commands Crest to switch between healing or attack mode. Interesting. Seems like a magic person. Let's give you that. Risky heal doesn't sound like the worst thing in the world. Unable to act next turn. It's probably not. Not good. Your heal all is. Uh, watch him call it. This is probably the same heal all. It it could be good in emergencies. I I think I'll not use it right now though. Let's go with a TP up. Raise multi shots. Channel energy skills cost no TP for two turns. Interesting. Inflicts wet. Uh, so definitely give you some mind. Some magic. Although I guess magic is. Magic seems like uh, not a great choice.
But whatever, it's not like we have access to attack, so. Um, definitely get raised. We'll get multi-shot. Uh, channel energy, I guess, is interesting. Defense, we'll get defense up for you. We need two more skills. We'll just grab that to grab that. And counter mind, I guess. Reduces physical damage taken by 15%. So now I know what shield and aura do. That's great. Uh, physical damage for 1.5. 10% chance for crest to block and attack for Amalia. That sounds great. Best friend. When Amalia defends, Crest attacks, dealing one X. Whoa! 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 Um. Homeboy Slice has an ability that gives us shield and aura, so this is certainly not worth taking. Uh, cure status ailments is, is pretty solid. I think I'm going to go mind and crest block. Wait, did I accidentally take defend gain TP at some point? That's, that's not what I wanted. go with crest block. That seems insane. Um, medical water. Defend game TP. Pretty terrible. Press block goes up to 15%. Pretty nice. Um, oh no, this is a better heal all. Okay. Right off the bat, it's better. This Crest Command is an interesting one. Definitely very interested in seeing what she's all about. Do you get a sky armor? No. Uh, equipment wise, looks like you're good there. So we want to give you something with mind. All right, we'll start with that. We'll give you cleric. Now, formation-wise, this is where things get a little awkward. I think Amalia is going to go there. Here's the thing. I don't see a use for Victor anymore. Uh, 
Yeah, I, I don't see a use for Victor anymore. And if that's the case, then he needs to be where he's at right now. Uh, it's been your first full week in the new title. And what a mess it's been. I, You got promoted, Dante? You never told me this. You just fall off the face of the earth because, you know, you're being a lawyer now. And then, you, you know, you don't, you don't keep me apprised of all the drama. Come on, Dante. You know how much I love drama? Especially workplace drama? back to the shop by an upgrade for Amalia just gonna go handle that real quick that gives her additional magic as well Hakan Mushsi. being the hero everyone needs uh, well in this case Dante is definitely stepping in for for uh, a good thing guy done goofed you're the bare minimum at the moment yeah your boss went into early retirement because of medical related things and you took over as interim vp oh dante is moving on up Character in suits? Is that, is that a joke? 
Dante? Dante, you're going to law school. You're... You're being a director at your work. And now... You're on a television show? Only Dante could, could juggle all of this. All right, Amalia. Let's see what this crest thing does. I can't eat people? Come on. Basically, the board has six months to find a replacement or make the change permanent. You don't think your job would make for interesting TV? I think, I think everyone's job can be embellished just a little bit. Uh, I, had a, I had a job where I, I felt it would have made for, for good TV. Like a thousand percent. Boss always walking in, yelling at people and stuff like that. I remember one day, I, uh, I had, where's this going? There was one day where I had secured the company a bunch of work that they, like, they were struggling to get some work, and I had, I had gotten, the, you know, the company a, a bunch of work, and the, like, the boss, like, the owner of the company, he was so happy, he wheeled me in my chair all around the office, um, and the very next day he was yelling at us for for not doing you know enough work and things like that <laughs> just like this <laughs> this is crazy Confused what this dog is supposed to do. Oh my gosh. Dante dropping a hundred thousand. Holy cow. Come back to that later. We also did get a defense gorget. What are you currently using? Oh. Guess you're using that. Dante matches your 100k. He does. I think. Uh, I think that makes Castlevania Symphony of the Night take the lead. I, I think someone put some points towards that recently. Somewhat recently. Dante's definitely been around the block. He's got some points. I 
There's a decent chance you don't have to put Law School on pause with this role change, but you're using the summer to figure out if you can manage both this fall. Okay. There's, uh, I guess depending on how you look at it, it it's somewhat a little disappointing that you might have to give up one for the other. What did I just get? Festival ribbon? I have no idea what I just got. just saw one that gave mine and percent this one this one you started the symphony of the night pick I think technically uh, it was Holy Man Bob. I think. But, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll give you the credit, Mr. Jared. You deserve the credit, too. Uh, personally, it is not much of a surprise that Dante would want me to play Symphony of the Night. Because Dante is a very big fan of Metroidvanias. And to that regard, Castlevania Symphony of the Night is one of Dante's favorite games. Fighting Dante, that's a madness you'll take. <laughs> Could it be that I just missed a switch? I admit, I was not paying attention to to what happened when I flipped the switch over here, but I did see the, the third switch, which certainly confuses me. Oh, here we, here we go. There we go. We did it to troll. See? Mr. JRPG is channeling that 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 mentality that uh, that I don't want to associate like that mentality of I knew this was going to happen 
when I did viewer requests. But man, did I wish that people wouldn't have that mentality. to play games he enjoys. Speaking, well, not speaking of games that I've enjoyed because I know nothing about this game. But, uh, I found out that Grandia 3 is on the PlayStation 3. Uh, so I went ahead and purchased that. Uh, it was $10. Uh, so I don't have to, I don't have to emulate it. Reboot. That said, Grandia 3 is eight gigabytes. Eight. Uh, Xeno Gears is 700 megabytes. Thankfully, I only had to delete two games. But that really, uh, really caught me by surprise. Oh, I need a mark. Oops. Even mark. <laughs> 